Hi, my name is Nidia Gutierrez and I'm a student in the Industrial Design and Technology program. Um, the assignment was to choose two tools. I decided to choose Poplet and Scratch. Poplet is, an, is a tool that is used for mind mapping, brainstorming, and visual algorithms. You're able to create and associate all those different, all those different patterns. Now, Scratch is a tool that I chose when I was doing my assignment with the MFA and MIT as for video gaming interactive algorithms, animations, and to make learning fun. Poplet is a tool that is able to get and understand visualization. What is mind mapping? What is harmonic? How do you associate ideas? How do you use this? How do you stimulate the mind of a kid? How do you make learning fun? The main use of Poplet is creative, animated, visual algorithms, associating points, and interactive. It's going to be able to make mind mapping fun for a younger kid. Now we have Scratch. Scratch is an interesting tool. I actually did a research when I was working my assignment with MIT and the MFA. The idea is to um, create animated videos, um, animated videos, presentations, interactive, to make learning fun as well. Um, you're able to use visual algorithm, make coding fun for young kids. Those two tools are able to make creativity, learning theories, and to correlate different association areas. Learning is meant to be fun, creative, and stimulating. Poplet idealizes, creates a mind mapping about what you're going to learn. Scratch creates an interactive media with the gaming and the user. Basically, how is the kid going to do Scratch and coding and program? The main purpose of those two tools are to innovate and stimulate creativity, influence the way learning is made, and make most important education fun media.